beautiful people and welcome back to our channel bartending home with john and kim today we are making two cocktails to celebrate the release of the last jedi the new star wars movie Yay! i will be making the floating yoda so it's kind of like a white russian but there's going to be mint chocolate chip ice cream that will look like yoda's head floating on top uh and i'll be making a kylo ren cocktail so we got a kylo ren margarita recipe off of followthatforth.com and we substituted a few of the items so we have rum instead of tequila and we have a, a hibiscus syrup yeah so we got the rum because i couldn't find black food coloring anywhere and then there was no black vodka either so i was like maybe we should just do black rum so we're just gonna give this a try friends all right so if you'd like to see how these cocktails are made please stay tuned so we're starting off with two ounces of black rum two ounces of cointreau and then one ounce of lime juice Six ounces of blackberries, which is the whole thing. So that's for the blender portion. So the Kylo Ren is actually a layered cocktail. So we're gonna have one ounce of cher black cherry juice mixed with half an ounce of hibiscus syrup. Just gonna mix this up. So we're gonna have our mixture, our juice mixture on the bottom. So for the floating Yoda, it's very easy. You just build it in your glass. So usually you would fill it up with ice, but because it's Star Wars, we are using a lovely Death Star ice sphere. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, <laughs> but yes. So you're just gonna pop that in the glass without dropping it. There we go, yay. And to that, I'm going to add one ounce of vodka. One ounce of Tia Maria. So use the original recipe called for Kahlua, but we, we have Tia Maria, so just use what you have. And then you're just gonna top it off with some milk. Again, use what you have. We have soy milk, so for those who are lactose intolerant, there you go. Perfect. So don't fill it all the way to the top, just so you have some room for that lovely ice cream. So we have lovely Briars mint chocolate chip ice cream. Okay. So it's a little bright, but that's okay. I also picked up a different brand, and it was brown <laughs> inside. I was so sad, guys. But yes, yeah, so just make a lovely scoop. It's just been out for a little bit, room temperature, just so it softens up a bit. And just put that on top. All right, and there you have it, our two Star Wars themed cocktails. So, oh, we're gonna give this a try. <laughs> we haven't tried these before, so we're gonna see how I don't want to move this. Well, I like mine. 
That's really nice, actually. Yeah? I think it settled down a bit. I was testing a bit while I was pouring it out, and it was super strong. So the berries actually, it blended a lot better than I expected, so the flavors are pretty good. Yay! Yeah, I mean, it's our first layered cocktail. I mean, as I'm drinking, I'm just drinking the top, so I don't know if I'm supposed to mix it and get to the bottom and get that cher cherry juice and hibiscus syrup mixed in, but yeah. who knows? With mine, it's really yummy. It's like um. Like a chocolate milkshake. It's minty and delicious and like coffee-like and you know, maybe not like that, but <laughs> just give it a sip. Okay. Just, just give it a try. I think it'll be okay. I like how it tastes. Mmm. Um, it'll probably give me a stomach ache eventually, but I'm, I'm not gonna eat the ice cream, so. Just a little one. <laughs> but this is actually really good. It's strong. For sure, so be aware of the dark side here. <laughs> yeah, it has four ounces of alcohol in it. So we strained the blackberry seeds out. Um, I guess you can't do anything about it, maybe. But yeah, and it's, it's so we use black cherry juice. Uh, in the Kylo Ren margarita, they actually had a, a, a light colored bottom, so a nice red color and a really a black upper layer. So that's why, um, so it's a lot more apparent between the two layers. Our colors are a lot more similar so because we, we had a black cherry juice and then we didn't actually have, well, we didn't want to use black food coloring so we stuck with black rum and it turned out, it took on the color of the blackberries. Mmm, I like my floating Yoda though. <laughs> Okay, so now that we started a bit, you can uh, you get the syrup in it. It's actually, I prefer it without the syrup. Like just the natural fruit sugars are really nice with the Cointreau as well. That's true. Syrup's a bit sweet for me, but that, that's okay. Mm -hmm. But yes, again, it is a boozy drink, but you need it, the booze, to be able to layer the cocktail to make it, to make sure it floats on top. That's why there's more sugar on the bottom, so it stays on the bottom. Okay? Specific gravities. Yay! Science! I'm good. <laughs> Alright, and that is all for today. Thanks for joining us today, guys, on the special episode of Themed Cocktails with Star Wars that has come out today. Yay. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos, and click in the links below for our previous videos, our alcohols, and also other cocktails. Remember, you will never succeed if you're afraid to try. So try, try, try! And be adventurous, my friends. And drink responsibly.